Welcome to Google Fi Pixel 7 Pro and the Pixel 7. I mean, very exciting event yesterday. I think I'm super excited. Probably better than I expected. Now, we were talking about the zoom going from a 4 times 48 megapixel zoom camera to a 5 times 48 megapixel zoom camera. And that's what we got. <laughs> but then Google started talking about doing what Apple's doing which is taking the main sensor, 50 megapixels, and then on a two times crop, cropping into the center of the sensor so that you don't lose any of the quality on a two times zoom. And then they talked about taking the five times zoom and cropping into the middle of the sensor and having a 10 times zoom where you don't lose any quality. Now, when we get the Pixel 7 Pro in our hands, which mine will be here next week because I ordered it yesterday during my lunch, then we'll be able to test that and see if the brand new Pixel 7 Pro indeed has the best zoom camera in smartphonedom. Is that a word? Smartphonedom? I guess it is now. So I have the Samsung S22 that I'm using as my webcam right now. And when I went in to order my Pixel 7 Pro yesterday, I decided not to turn in my Samsung S22. I'm going to keep it as my second camera. So that's good. So when I get the Pixel 7 Pro next week, I can take the S22 and the Pixel 7 Pro to the park and compare the zoom quality and see if it indeed has improved on the Pixel 7 Pro. Now, I was watching a video earlier today, and I'll actually I'll link it in the description below. This guy works at an AT&T store, so he busted out some of the Pixel 7s and took them outside and took some pictures and some video. Um, I'm not going to rip off his content you just go watch his video but the pictures were amazing the video looked really amazing and i'm super even more super excited about the pixel 7 pro in my hands next week than i was so how can you get it well <laughs> google fi of course i talk about google fi a lot because i use google fi i love google fi google fi uses the t-mobile towers also us cellular i believe uh, at least here in Lubbock, I get great coverage all over town, 5G in parts of town. That's kind of the way it is. And it's great. I love it. So that's why I talk about it. And here's Google Fi's website, fi.google.com. Here are the deals that they're offering on their own Pixel phone. So you can pre-order now, save up to $200 on the Pixel 7 and Pixel 7 Pro if you're still looking for Samsung phones, look at that, up to $1,000 off on those. So check those out if you're looking for a Samsung phone right now. But pre-ordering the Pixel 7 goes a lot like this. When you scroll down, there it is, this Pixel 7 Pro for 29, I'm looking over, you can see it here, but I'm looking over here, uh, $29.12 a month or $699 if you buy it outright. Or the Pixel 7 also for $200 off, or the Pixel 6a, you can get $100 off that if you still want that. But if you're pre-ordering the 7 Pro, it looks something like this. Here's the uh, deal. You can do 0% financing for two years, or you can pay $699 right up front. And you can pre-order it today. And when I hit that, it asked me to log in. And you can also do the Pixel Pass subscription. Now, I didn't do this. I don't qualify for this because I already have these services. But you do get the uh, Pixel 7 Pro to keep. You get YouTube Premium, YouTube uh, Music Premium, which I have those two. Those come together at around 10 bucks, 11 bucks a month, something like that. Device protection thrown in. Uh, Google One 200 gigabytes with this 55 for a month. I've got the two terabyte plan for another $10. I'm giving Google all my money, apparently. Uh, the Google Play Pass with this. And you get $5 off of your Fi service. Now, you know, you can get over to go over to Fi and check these deals out for your own self. And if you decide to get a Pixel on Google Fi or any other phone and activate it on Google Fi, you are going to have to adhere to these promo details. Now, keep in mind, you can use my referral link in the link in the description. And uh, after you're on Fi for 30 days, you'll get $20 off your bill one time. And I'll get $20 off of my bill as well. So help support the channel. I really do appreciate that. But here's how you get the $200 off your 7 and your 7 Pro. You have to be a new Fi customer, and then you have to activate within 30 days of receiving it or 30 days of shipment, and then keep the phone active on Fi for 60 
consecutive days. So you will have to do that. Keep it on Phi for 60 consecutive days. But what I really like about Phi is there are no contracts. It's not a lease. So, you know, you can take your phone. Of course, if you do leave Phi then, and you're doing it on payments, you'll have to pay off the phone. So there is that. But once you pay off the phone or if you bring a phone you've already paid off, you don't have a lease. You can just leave whenever you want, if you want. Um, but if you're like me, you like it so much you stick around. Now, the Pixel 7 Pro itself with that camera is going to be fire, I'm telling you. Now, the other thing they added was, I mean, I'm really happy to see this. I'm looking forward to trying this. They, they added macro to the ultra-wide camera. So that's going to be really good. And then it looks like they enhanced some of the services they already had in there where the dictation was just amazing on the recording. Uh, apparently, the dictation services in your, in your messages are going to be even better. And uh, it'll, instead of listening to audio, you can, it'll just read it back to you. I mean, you can see the text. And that, that goes, that in fact, that was on the 6 Pro too. Um, Google's getting really good with their artificial intelligence. So it's a very exciting times to be alive, definitely. And of course, it makes it easier for them to track you, but I don't care. <laughs> I'm even a local guide on Google Maps, so I'm all the way in, you know what I'm saying? So the Google Pixel 7 Pro should be in my hands next week, Friday or Saturday is what they're saying. It hasn't shipped yet. I'm hoping to get a day or two early. That would be awesome. But we'll definitely take it to the park, compare it to the Samsung on some videos. I'll probably just take it for a test drive and show you what it looks like and what it feels like and what it's like. Uh, the hazel color I hear looks even better in person with that gold finish. So I'm excited about it. And I should have it soon. And when I do, I'll share it with you. I mean, I'll share the experience with you. Right. We'll see you soon.